Hey guys, it's Ed with CMC Reptiles. Wanted to do another video on the frog. Um, Riley from Riley Reptiles put up a cool video this morning uh, feeding his uh, Kribos the tilapia. So he kind of brought up an interesting topic about how, you know, there's a lot of keepers that are kind of set on just feeding their animals whatever rainbow mealworm cells uh, like with this guy I feed him all kinds of stuff uh, night crawlers right here you got some small night crawlers he's gonna feed on and uh, power you know I feed him super worms horned worms crickets but most of these animals are opportunist hunters so they'll eat whatever is pretty much available so the neat thing, I'm going to try to feed a little tilapia for this guy. And the thing is, is i got to make it move, otherwise he won't eat it. See? <laughs> He's trying to eat the tongs. But their, their feeding response is, is based on movement. That's the difference between the Kribo and these frogs. The Kribo will eat just by scent. The frog's only going to eat by movement. See, as soon as the prongs aren't there, I'm going to try something else and get a different pair of tongs. Okay, so I'm going to try to get the... If I could just get the... There he goes. See, as long as he sees the food move, he'll eat it. Um... If it's not moving, there he goes. There he goes. See, now he's pounding down the tilapia. Tilapia is high, <coughs> high in protein. And that's one thing you need to mix their food up is you want to give them fats, proteins, food with calcium. I even dust these things. Right now he's he's getting the hook. See, he sees the hook moving. Come on, buddy. But again, these things are opportunist hunters. They will eat anything. And right now, see, his eyes are on the hook, not the tilapia. So he's not going by scent. He's only going by movement. Unlike uh, Riley's Kribo. Come on, buddy. There he goes. But you kind of get the idea. And feeding the sloppy is just a really healthy way to go, too. A really healthy way. Some animals will get a little bit impacted when you overfeed them, like crickets or even the uh, superworms. But the tilapia is perfect. So thanks, Riley, for the great idea because it's definitely something I'll start doing. And like he showed on the video, it's actually very inexpensive. And it goes a long way. But if I could just make it move a little bit. Like I said, based on movement, he sees that. But these cane, this is a cane toad, it's a male. It's very big, and it's going to get bigger. There he goes. But, you know, he'll be good. I mean, look at the gut on that guy. Just a really big animal. He said, I like feeding him a little bit of everything. You really need to change the diet up because, you know, it's not like these guys, you know, walk up to a drive through at Rainbow Mealworms and ask for a dozen super worms and two dozen horned worms and some crickets. In the wild, these guys eat whatever goes in front of them, whether it be, you know, lizards, snakes, baby birds, um, anything that moves that they could fit in their mouth. They are going to eat. Guaranteed. Um, I also feed this guy rats. But the rats are, I do less, because rats are really high in fat. And um, they have a little bit of calcium because of the bone. 
but I actually dust his super worms and night crawlers with calcium powder so that works out perfect and I could do the same thing with the tilapia so here he's got a good meal in his belly now eating some nice big chunks of tilapia it's easy on the stomach you know I did feed him a live uh, rat pup the other day and that thing was squeaking in its belly for about 20 minutes after he ate it because they eat they eat the animals live and then I started kind of panicking if that rat bit him <laughs> but it's pretty neat how aggressive food aggressive these guys are when it comes to when it comes to eating but pretty cool that he just took down a, you know maybe five six ounces of tilapia so he's good for a few days now won't have to feed him for a while good you know high protein diet for him and just kind of want to share that again real cool video Riley those Kribos are pretty badass that you got I'll talk to you guys later